going to the moon is something we all like and that's the truth we are about to launch into the skies what we are watching in front of us is the reality or the truth this time around there's a big difference it's not only going to be the retail herd which is just starting to come it's the institutional herd which is already in the market which means you're getting crushed on the fiat and people are making a life in crypto so if you cannot become a millionaire in this crypto market in next three months to six months from smart contracts payments gaming all the way up to infrastructure projects most likely you're not going to be one in next five to ten years this is that opportunity which you really don't want to miss mass allocations into crypto is starting think about it this is the altcoin market and the searches for last five years last time you did something like this after without moving for a long period when you started moving that was the time where you made a shit done load of money if you were in the market back then if you are new to the market consider yourself lucky because you entered in this phase especially for those who started in next six last six months think about it the market is now blowing through fetch 35 percent plus is it rx 30 percent rsi 45 percent all of these are not meme coins these are fundamental coins and that's why we had our targets this is like four months back and the, we did follow up everything but right here right now keep this in mind from there 0.45 where's the price 2.25 so you literally did a 500 percent run up in just one asset we followed it up obviously where you can buy how you can ride and all say is it rx this was like you know maybe a few days back showing okay guys we are about to launch what happens the price goes up same rsr you look at this the price is up 45 percent we talked about this maybe a few weeks two weeks back saying this is an opportunity that's a breakout watch the price is now above this target two so the market is literally taking off and you need to make sure you understand where the real opportunities are welcome to the Sinovic investor family where the normal retail guys get to learn how to become the next top 10 person of this world thousand plus members are there in the si family taking benefit of all these calls remember we went through a euphoric phase in just trading back going up from say for example a thousand dollar all the way up to sixteen thousand that's not a small deal to do literally a 16x in this market and where the market is just starting so this phase this is where we made that so in the next phase where the market goes nuts what do you think is possible and if you are well educated about the opportunities which exist in this market ah this is going to be fantastic look at the dollar the dollar is getting rejected it's slowing down that gives a boost to the crypto market so yes we dropped from 69 all the way down to like 57 fine right now we are at 66 700 so we've been flirting with this particular level for a few hours now that four hour candle shows you we're getting some liquidity as we reach to the upside but it doesn't change the fact that we came back up and all coins are crushing it look at bitcoin up 4.5 percent look at ether that's up 8.39 yes it's true xrp has not done better than bitcoin because that's the phase in which it is breakout and a retest we're just starting to bounce back up but remember you're not only in xrp in this market this is an entire market all coins this is total three which excludes ether for sure but you get to see this the market is trending back higher daily is going into the overbought region and three day weekly all of them showing you something similar the market is in overbought territory don't take it negatively that's where people mess things 
when it's overbought here, that is in RSI, it shows you the strength, relative strength index of what? Buying and selling, nothing else. So when the buying strength is through the roof, what do you think the selling strength is? It's at the flow, which means, yes, they're going to come back, but a little bit of addition into the buying strength means, boom, there is a giant candle like this. You pop through the roof. Now, to understand when the next local pop comes in, you literally have to come down here onto a four hour chart or a daily chart. Look at when they are re entering that zone. That makes a lot of difference. So, say here for XRP, you are now down to 58 on a daily. So, the moment you realize that comes back to 70, yeah, look for another big pop. That should be a continuation movement because on a Three day chart, you are now literally grinding the one, the two, the three kind of move trending to the upside into this range of overbought territory. And while you're in this market, don't forget that this market is now showing you 30, 40, 50, 60 percent run up just in the top 100 coins. We're not talking about micro cap or nano caps. These are large cap crypto projects with hundreds of millions of daily trading volume which are now doing these big numbers. And that's why I strongly believe this will only increase from here. Say, if it's altcoins and you don't like it, go look at crypto. As in general format, if you are looking at the entire market, say cryptocurrencies, what are you watching here? It's just starting to take off. That's something good because when you go back five years on the mem coins, this is what you see. You have the phase, the phase one. Now it's the phase two. Mm. That means a lot. Last time this kind of movement happened, that was a 2021 entire run up. Earlier 2021, March, April. Then you got that by October, November. So that type of a run up was happening in front of you in mem coins and for the entire crypto market. Don't miss this. If you zoom out, to the historical movement. This is what you're watching. So each time you're going up, your bottom is not coming back down. So there are always demand on the retail side who are constantly searching and learning about crypto. Yes, that's the 0.01 person who would like to learn more and be accurate about their decisions and to enter the right projects to make the biggest gains. So if you see this correctly, that means something like 2021 or 2017 is coming in front of you. So I repeat, in next three to six months, in entire different segments of crypto market, if you cannot make a million dollar, if you haven't made that yet, it's going to be really hard for you to do that in the next five to 10 years. This is a life changing opportunity in front of you. So when you are on these macro charts, understand that they follow a trend, a direction which you can easily follow till they pop through the roof. What do I mean? You go on a monthly and ask yourself, are we through the roof yet? No, we are not. This is where you are when you are through the roof, at least 80 plus on the RSI. You go look at any asset that has done extremely well over a period of time in this cycle, you will see them reaching that range of 78, 80 on a monthly chart. Now we are nowhere near there, right? So that was above, remember, the price went from like $10 all the way up to $600. That's a bubble. That's the pure price-based definition of a bubble. That's how you see that. But when you enter assets like XRP, XLM and others, this is where your monthly RSI is at. You have a long way to go. That means, yeah, you need a ton more patience to ride those assets to the upside. It's not going to be easy. They won't let you do that that easily. Whales don't want you, me and others, make money super easy. You would like to be on that top 5%. Join the SF family. Now, guys, if you haven't smashed that like button yet, consider doing that. That supports the growth of the channel. And we spread the message as well. And when I say spread the message, what is it about? The message is clear. There are people who are riding this wave like crazy. Some have started 
yeah, the leverage is extremely high. I would like to caution you guys, don't do that kind of a leverage unless you, sh you are super sure about your risk tolerance. And if you have those, fine. If that's the $2,000 which you're gambling with, 100%, go for it. If not, don't. But the thing is that guy turned $2,000 into 80K in one asset with my calls. So I'm super, super emotional watching this because people are changing their lives in SI family. And in SI family, we don't actually do huge amount of movements, right? We do with normal little bit of leverages. <clears throat> what you're watching in front of us is the accurate change of the trading bag. This is last six months, especially in last four months we have done this. So that's a huge move. We went up to 16x in that trading bag. Each time you go up, yes, there is a consolidation. We rebalance, we find new assets, drop it into them. At some of these peaks, we take our capital out. We take some profits out. So yeah, that drops. Then we reallocate into different assets. Then the market go up. You are literally accelerating in this region. Why? Because the market is showing you a ton of those opportunities. And whenever I see one, whenever I buy one, I sell something, I inform you guys via the alerts. You see the screenshots, you see me dropping audio messages. So you know what I'm doing, why I'm doing those. Now, come back into the XRP chart. You're all looking at this. I don't want you to be euphoric now. For XRP especially, don't be euphoric now. We're just in the retest phase. We need to grind higher. We need to break 0.67. That's where some more optimism will come in. Now, this is the reality. You look at this and you saw like the altcoins, the altcoin market as a whole is kind of starting to trend, right? It's, it's projected to go through the roof, which is bigger than 2021. That's the amount of volume entering here. So what does that mean? The market is about to blow through and if you are well informed, you're about to become a ultra wealthy individual. See, if you're starting just from $1,000, your aim is just a million dollar. Fine, that still is a good amount. If you're starting with 100, no, your aim is much higher. Yes, your risk tolerance is much lower. That depends. Now, in that entire market, if you come on to XRP, you want to look at XRP as a cryptocurrency, this is what you see. Okay, it's starting to go back up. If we consider all this history, if we go on the last five years, this is what you're watching. We're not seeing a euphoric increase in search volume. And we're not seeing all of these volume from just one area. We are watching that spread through. So if you now take it as a ripple, you're watching there is a little bit of increase, but not like what we really would like to see. But when you come on to the last 12 months, you're seeing, okay, something is happening. We're trying to pick up. That's good. But as of now, you haven't seen that amount of euphoria coming in. If you actually go on to multiple different projects, say for example, r and you saw the price running through and that was followed up with these searches based on the history. Now, you can literally do this going into the price action. You take whichever asset you want, especially those mem coins. And that's why I started with mem coins. Some of them were actually blowing through. So this is the reality of the market. If you are in these assets, ride them. When they show you I'm about to do this, believe them. That's hard, but it's easy. <laughs> when you're executing that. If you try to make it complex, it's super complex, it's hard. Other than that, just keep your eyes on Bitcoin. Just keep your eyes on the Bitcoin dominance because this one, was already showing you what we talked in last couple of videos. That got confirmed. Great. Now, you go down the rabbit hole, you take into the Bitcoin dominance and you're looking at this. Mm. When we reach this level of 54 all the way up to 55, it's getting a lot of liquidity. Or in other words, money starts rolling back into the altcoins. And we've been riding this trend in Bitcoin towards all coin, that kind of a run from this local bottom to this day, like 553 days of movement. That means there is something you should think about. There is maybe an intermediate drop 
in the Bitcoin dominance and all coins pop through the roof and maybe that's what the entire market is showing you. When that market shows you something, when you understand the fact that masses are riding into this compared to the last 12 months, you should better be prepared for that. And that's why I say join the SF family, get these charts at the right time. When the price is down, it's hard to call those. When the price is at 0.5 saying, okay, look, it's going to come to this range and bounce to $2. It, not the, it is not the easiest thing. But now the price is above this target. I don't have a measured move above this. So if it's me, I'm out from that asset for sure. So I'm being faithful to my members there, showing you guys this as an opportunity. But understand, price does do all of this. And that's where you make that utility of those charts. So if you want to join the 1000 plus members in the SI family, use the link in the description below in YouTube or in the bio in Twitter. So guys, again, if you haven't smashed the like button yet, I would request consider doing that. I'll meet you guys on the next video. Bye for now.